welcome to another episode of Pinterest Designs. So, some awesome news is that I'm going to be an aunt. Uh, my sister is having a baby boy. She's due February 23rd. And I am throwing her a baby shower along with a couple of our mutual friends. Um, it's going to be a co-ed baby shower and it's going to be a fiesta theme. It's going to be really fun. Um, so the next few videos, um, for, probably for the next few weeks here, are going to be kind of baby shower theme. I'm trying to do a lot of like DIY projects, especially for the decor and everything, to keep it um, less expensive. So, so this week, um, kind of playing off this whole fiesta theme here, I'm making some special fancy streamers. If you've ever seen the um, Mexican like flags that you string up, I think um, they're called pa papel picado. Um, I'm going to be kind of making those but with streamers. Like always, I will put the link to the pin for my pinspiration uh, for this project. So for this project, you're obviously going to need some streamers, some crepe paper. Um, pick these up at Party City for 99 cents. So I got all the colors of the invitation and kind of the color scheme that we're going to go with for the party. And then I have a hole punch and some scissors. So the pin says just to use a couple feet of crepe paper at a time to make uh, folding easier. So I'm going to cut a couple feet and then I need to fold them over like an accordion style so it is a couple of inches long. Kind of depending on how long you want it, the flags to be. So I'm just going to do this. Alright, so now that you have it all folded over, what I need to do next is cut out a little section of the crepe paper on the side here. So I'm going to cut up maybe, you know, a centimeter or two in, cut up, not all the way though, and then snip out a little box like this. And I'm going to do that on both sides. So then these are going to be your little flags that are hanging down. For this first design, I'm just going to do a bunch of hole punch dots all over and then I'll show you a different design after this. And then when you unfold it, I think it turned out really well. So obviously, as you can see, this isn't too long, so I'm going to have to make um, multiple of each design and then just tape them all together. But I think it turned out really well. I'm going to try one different design with a different color. Alright, so I'm going to do a different pattern on a different color. Here's a hot pink color that I have already have folded over. I'm going to cut out the same little rectangle areas to form the flag in the middle. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to fold it over again and I'm going to make a triangle in the middle. So I'm going to cut in a little bit here and then cut diagonally down like this to make uh, the half of the triangle. So then when I do unfold it is the triangle in the middle. And then I think, you know, you can do whatever design you want. I think I'm just going to make a couple of dots. Um, hole punches on either side here. Maybe three up the side. Same thing on the other side. Awesome. So there's my flag. Unfold it. Cute. I like that design. Cool. So the, and the beauty of this is you can't really mess up. I mean, you can do whatever design you want to. You obviously just have to be careful of where you're cutting so you don't cut through something. Um, all right, the last pattern I'm going to show you is um, just three triangles in a row. So again, I'm going to cut out my rectangles on the side. And 
And then I'm going to fold it over just like the last triangle. I'm going to try to make them kind of smaller. So cut in and down. we go. So I think you guys kind of get the idea. You can do any pattern you want to as long as you're careful where you're cutting. Um, you could do different shapes than triangles too. So I've just been stacking my finished ones kind of in a pile over here and what I'm going to do next or what I would be doing next is taping them all together to make whatever length I need. Um, I'm just going to continue to make them throughout the week in the evening so I'm not Unfortunately, going to be able to show you them all together, but you get the picture. I think they are going to turn out really well, and they're going to go with our fiesta theme for the baby party perfectly. Thanks for tuning in this week to another episode of Pinterest Designs. Make sure to check back weekly and subscribe. Bye, guys.